What happens when you place bacon and a photo of SCP-682 into SCP-914? Dr. Curtis decided to find out. One pound of fully cooked bacon and a photograph of SCP-682 were placed into the clockworks on the setting very fine. The output produced was a 5-inch miniature replica of SCP-682, made from bacon and photo paper. The object was able to move on its own and displayed hostile behavior towards all life. Its small size prevented it from doing any damage, but it did attempt to breach containment and kill all staff in the vicinity. When the creature moved, it produced a sizzling sound like that of bacon in a hot pan.